Um, so I picked question number 26 in the open stats textbook, and that question is write the balanced cell reaction for the cell schematic below. Calculate the standard cell potential and note whether the reaction is spontaneous under standard state conditions. So first you look at the schematic below given, and I always like to write that this side is the anode and this side of the schematic is the cathode. I also like to write underneath, just so I remember, that the anode is always oxidized, and the cathode is always reduced. Then I look at what's given, and I go through the charges of everything. So this one would be zero because it's a solid. This one would also be zero. So it's usually a spectator and won't be used in the reaction. Then I look at the hydrogen and I start writing the half reaction. So H2 gas goes to H plus aqueous. And then you go through the half reaction steps. So you note that there's two hydrogens on this side. So the first thing you have to do is do two on this side. Then since it's an oxidation reaction, you have to do the electrons. And since this is gas, this would be zero. I like to write it up here. This would be plus one. This would also be zero. And this would be negative one. I like to just see it up top. And then since it's an oxidation reaction, the electrons go on the product side because yes. And there's two because there's two, two plus here. To make it zero, it balances the charges. And then you're done with this half reaction. Then I like to move on to the reduction half reaction. And that would be this. I like to leave a lot of room on either side of the arrow just to add stuff in. And then same thing as the one above. Since there's two BR, you have to balance the atoms first. And then since it's a reduction, you put the elections on this side of the equation. And then both of these reactions are now right. The half reactions are done. And then I like to draw a line, and then overall reaction. And then you just, first you look at what um, cancels out. So since there's electrons on both sides, you cancel those out. And then you just add them together. That's one part of the problem. And then it also asks for the, so that's the balanced cell reaction. That's that part of the question. Then it asks for the calculated standard cell potential. So all the reduction re half reactions are stated in the textbook. So I looked those up and then you see that hydrogen is zero and then br is plus 1.0873 and then you since there it's given to you in the reduction you're supposed to switch the oxidation sign but since it's zero you don't have to do that and then you add them together, you do, um, and then, so the standard cell potential 
would be this. That's the standard cell potential. And since the standard cell potential is positive, it also means that this reaction is spontaneous. And that's all you have to do.